these. Then I'm gonna make some sprinkle stuff. <laughs> I chose these sprinkles because I really like the packaging. <laughs> Hello and welcome. So today I thought in spite of Valentine's Day we're going to be making some red velvet cupcakes. We have our cake cases. Baking tin. And you know we're just going to get swinging. I kind of got like my ingredients prepared now. Because I thought this might probably go wrong if I tried making the batter myself because it tends to happen. I'm using a cake mix because why not? Um, we're going to begin by adding this, which is the powder. You know, these, this recipe, if you want to call it tutorial baking extravaganza, you're on a budget for Valentine's Day and you haven't got enough money to buy your boo a nice little Valentine's Day gift. Maybe some baked goods if you wish, um, or for yourself or if you're lonely. Uh, I for one am not lonely, however, I will not be eating these. So I have an egg. If my camera cuts out now, as so I've got eggy hands, I'm not going to be a happy girl. Don't you worry your little minds or big minds if you're intelligent Einstein kids. I have washed my hands prior to this, so you don't have to worry. I will not be giving myself any food diseases. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's time to lob in the water. I've got 200 ml here. You can follow along. I will leave like a link to the Betty Crocker recipe thing, but I mean, it's really not too difficult. I mean, if I can understand this, I think we could. Wow, look at that delicious mess. To be fair, that kind of looks quite good. Oh, there's a lovely egg yolk. Better whisk that. So if this is mainly all together. Um, I was actually going to do this video with Ellie. However, I couldn't get to her house because of the snow. So I didn't do it. So now it's when I did. As I thought, I needed to pre-film a video before I went away for holiday because by the time I got back I wouldn't want to be rushing to film and edit before Valentine's Day. If I could bathe in this, honestly I would, but I'm not going to because that's a silly decision. Right, lovely. I'm gonna get some up in here. I mean, look at that. Damn, she's sexy. So it's time for the taste test quickly. That's some good stuff, you know, just putting it on the, I think I may have excelled myself this time, or Betty did, so thanks Betty for helping me. So it's um, time to put the mixture in the cases. So today I've decided to use these sexy ones, because you know, zebra print is all the rage. So yeah, that's what we're doing. I don't actually know how many this is gonna make, so I actually have Two cake tins, but I don't think we would need all of them. Special. So now it's time to put. Not time to put them in the oven because how else are they going to cook? are all in the oven so they can cook. Alexa, start timer for 23 minutes. 23 minutes, starting now. Yeah, that said you need six or six and a half. Well, my school shoes were six, and they're fine, so six. Want black leather boots, don't zips. No, you don't want painting. Thank you. I actually have got a sad announcement to make for all of my viewers out there. So I thought I was being like an edgy YouTuber and having two different angles, but my time lapse of me filling up the cupcake cases with mixture was actually a slow mo. So I now have an hour's worth of footage slowed down. It was originally eight minutes, and I was like, oh, okay, this will be like 30 seconds long. No, it's just an hour of me scooping cupcake mixture into some cases. So 
We'll see if I insert that or not, most probably not. Um, but yeah, I'm really sorry to let you all down. I will try my hardest next time to read properly. Just a disclaimer, don't use fresh fruit or the raspberries like I mentioned on the cupcakes unless you know you're going to eat them within like two days. My experience was the raspberries went off because they had been out in the open and they produced mould and I don't think anyone really wants to eat mouldy cupcakes so unless you're going to eat them quickly don't put fruit on them. So that is actually the end of the video, that's all the footage I got, I was meant to film like the final product and the outro however prior to that i had like a miniature breakdown so it was an emotional time which i did capture uh some of <laughs> however here i am ending this so if you like this video it's a bit different for me give a thumbs up let me know in the comments if you liked like the baking video and if you want some baking cooking with Anna videos then I'd be happy to do that and stop gesticulating grobe because make me a happy galley see y'all home dogs home slices other from another mother's another time peace out queezers <laughs> Bernie bent it over for baby, she's selling I'ma stay banana, split I roll a split my garbage, you touch my shit.